Welcome back everyone to Stoneblade 27's Courageous Acts on Minecraft. This is Season 1, Episode 17, and today I'm going to be working on hammering out some achievements. So for this season, my main goal is to, in the end, get, um, just complete all these achievements, which then would be pretty much completing the game. So, I would like to start and get into work because I have gotten quite a few done. Um, all really the top ones are done. The other ones that I haven't done is, uh, fly a pig off a cliff. And for that, it requires a saddle and a stick. So I think I'm going to try to get that one done. It seems like there's a zombie pigman in my house. What are you doing? What are you doing? Um, yeah, okay. I'm just going to kill you. And you're dead. And you're dead. Oh, yeah. Um, got some rotten flesh. Put this away. And let's see. Um, oh, I do have a saddle, actually. Oh, this is this is very good. Uh, okay, let me get some string and some wood and some sticks and everything. Good. And let's see. Oh, but do I have carrots? Uh, I should have carrot. Did, did I not have carrots? Did... I thought the village had carrots. Maybe it didn't. Um, if it didn't do it, then that's fine. Um, if not, then... I just try to work my way down. So kill a skeleton with an arrow for more than 50 meters. It is night right now, so I guess I can uh, try to go for that one. So like I said, the purpose of this episode is just really try and get some more achievements done. So let's see. And I did that backwards, but that's okay. Oh, I already had a boat. Um, I saw that. Okay, I'm um, just gonna run outside. Oh, I do, in fact, need some food, which would be very good to have. Um, no, I don't even think I want some bread. Bread is delicious and easy to make. Okay. Eating some bread. Okay. One more. And it does not appear to be um, creatures out. Oh, there's a skeleton. Okay, let's go for mm, zombie. I don't even know if that's 50 blocks, but come on, come on, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead, and you're dead. Ow, and you're dead, and you're dead. Okay, skeleton, don't follow me, don't follow me. No, I need to kill you from 50 blocks away. Okay, let's see. Where's the skeleton go? There he is, there he is, there he is, and boom. Dang it. And boom. Oh no, that was getting in the way. And I missed both times. Okay, that's terrible. Die. Okay. Let's see. How close actually was I to hitting the skeleton? Oh, there's two of them. Maybe we can kill these. Uh, doesn't seem like I was close at all. No, no, no. No, no. I hate skeletons. They are the worst. Oh, wait. Two arrows. Two arrows. Good. Now, where did the second one go? Oh, there he is. Hello. No, no, no. No. Don't shoot me again. No. 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 Ugh. Skeletons! I need to get myself, I need to get myself. Okay, why skeletons? They're so overpowered in the new update. Like before, they were they were really easy to fight, but now they're just. He picked up all my armor! Oh, good, I got it back. That's good. Um, I thought I thought I lost my armor, because usually when you kill, kill creatures with armor, you don't get it back. And. Okay, now let's see. Skeletons. Or, okay. Okay, perfect. So, see, my arrows were eh, kind of far, but no worries. I will just find another skeleton if I can. Um, skeleton. Well, there's one down there, but he's got too much gold armor. I don't think I'll be able to kill him, but I don't think I'll be. Okay, let's just go go for the kill. Um, after I get rid of these obnoxious mobs. Okay, perfect. And now, mm, get out of my face. There we go. Okay, and let's see. Hit skeleton. Way off. Way off again. Okay. Please, mm, get out of here. Die. Thank you. Okay. Nope. I just can't shoot with a bow. Like, um... I used, used to be really good at shooting bows, and now it's just, like, really bad at it. Ow. Okay, there's a skeleton behind me. That's good. So I can finish off the skeleton over here. 
if I can. Oh gosh, you're gonna be overpowered and overpowered. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Okay, and oh, I'm just gonna use my axe for this. Hello, you are really creepy sounding. You are really creepy sounding. How much health do you have? Okay. Um. Okay, and oh, there's my arrow. Like really off of my aim. It's not good. Need to get better. And let's see. Not seeing too many skeletons about. That's not good. Let's see. Oh, some arrows. Yes. Okay, six arrows. Should be enough to kill a skeleton from a decent distance. And but this, this oh, this is out. Oh, oh gosh. I was just assaulted by like 50 billion creatures. What was that? Okay, let me just sleep. Let's just, let's, wow, that overpowered, like really, really overpowered. Um, yeah, just like, what was that? That was just like, I don't even know what happened to me there. That was like, I just, I just saw my health, like have half a heart left or a heart left. And then I just blew up and then I'm just like, oh. Hopefully my stuff didn't blow up, but I think the creeper blew me up, which means my stuff should still be somewhere. The remains of my dead body should be scattered somewhere around here. Hmm. Oh, there they are, there they are. Get all my stuff. No, no, creeper. Nope. Don't blow up my stuff. Creeper. Don't, don't, don't. Don't do it. No. Oh, no. I'm dead. I'm dead. You gotta be kidding me. These creatures are I just I don't even I don't even know what to do. These creatures are just uh they're ridiculous. Okay, I'm going back and get my stuff. I'm going to go back and get my stuff. Okay, so I got my stuff back and now Okay, I'm just I'm just trying to Okay, it seems like um uh, these last ones are kinda of, okay, throw it throw them down another plate. This one's like impossible to get. Uh deal nine hearts of damage in a single hit. That won't be too hard. Um, actually, no. If I got a sword, I probably want to enchant it. So I'm just gonna, let's see. Do I want to just need? It says travel by my at least one kilometer from where you start. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Um, eat a notch apple, and I'm actually very close to having all the gold I need for that. Or not super close, but um, part of the way there. Oh, I did that, that, that. So really, the only things I need to do is locate the end. Eat a notch apple and deal nine hearts of damage, travel on my cart. So really the only ones left are the really, really hard achievements or the harder achievements to get. I thought I saw an end of it over here. No, I didn't. Okay. Well I think what I'm gonna do is because I can always find more diamonds. For now, I'm just going to make myself a diamond sword. Um just Yep, just like that. So seven attack damage. And I'm just gonna go. I really can't do much, but I'm just gonna go off. Nope. And see if uh, what I can enchant on it. Probably nothing, but if I can get sharpness. Sharpness 3 requires oh, level 8. That's because I have all the bookshelves. I forgot about that. So let me just grab some torches. And this will do. Oh, no. Oh, they're there got them okay so now I'm just gonna go back over here and just kind of do that and let's see sharpness oh there it is um just requires level two okay this should not be hard to get let's um kill okay that's a nice looking horse I don't want to kill that one let's see um I could just mine some coal actually just quick, the quick ways of getting experience. Almost there. And two levels. Nope. Oh, there you go. Two levels. Okay, back to my enchantment table. Let's just add. Oh, sharpness to it. Nope, I'm just going to add sharpness. Okay, so it's not the greatest enchantment ever, but sharpness makes it do eight attack damage, which means. If I can just go and do like a jump kill or a jump hit, I should be able to do D9 
deal nine hearts of damage, which is going to be awesome. Um, and the only way to really do that is with the diamond sword. Um, but let me just grab my potatoes. Uncooked. Okay. Mm, delicious. Delicious potatoes. And what can I hit? Not the horse. Oh, I do have many sheep. And these potatoes take forever to eat. Okay, right, um, so, so sorry, horsey, but I think you're going to be our little test thingy to see if I can do nine hearts of damage. Get over here. Go. It's okay, horsey. You're not going to die. You're just going to lose most of your health. Actually, no horses have a decent amount of health. At least most of them do. So sorry, horse, if you have low health, you might die. I don't think so. I think the lowest thing I have is nine, so unless this horse is really unlucky. <laughs> that did not do nine. Okay, it looks like my, uh. Uh, I didn't get a critical hit. Let's try this. Let's go. Nope, that doesn't work either. Do they have to be, um, like, more above them? Like this? That just killed him. That's not what I wanted. Nope, and I missed him. We have to be running and jumping. And let's try this. Jump, jump. <laughs> nope, that didn't do it either. Ah. Uh, oh, so sorry, horse. You know, really, how do you deal nine hearts of damage? I thought you could just get a critical hit with a diamond sword, and it would be all good. But it says deal nine hearts of damage in a single hit. Oh, no, give me that. It is a very powerful sword, though. I'm very, very happy with it. But it's not, it's not doing... Huh, let me just check up how you actually do nine nine hearts of damage. Cause I thought you you didn't I thought you could do it with a sword without enchantments, but apparently maybe you can't. Let me just check this up real quick. Okay, so I figured it out and uh the best way to do it is cause either you either have like an, a diamond sword and a really high level of enchantment, or you just get a potion of strength. Strength two is best. And usually, like, sharpness on your sword, that just to be, uh, make sure. So what I'm going to do is go and brew myself a potion of strength, too. And so to do that, I'm going to need some water bottles. No, no, you don't make bottles with pains, do you? No, you don't. I need glass. Um, well, just because, yeah, I'm just going to use one bottle for now. It does, doesn't matter that much. Okay, here we go. Oh, and I don't need two blaze powder. I only need one, and let's see. I right, I'm just gonna wait till this is done. Okay, and now I got awkward potion, no effect. Add in the blaze powder. Okay, now I got a potion of strength, and now this should give me potion of strength two. And there we go, potion of strength two. So this thing is a very versatile potion, and I should easily damage nine hearts or maybe even 10 hearts i don't even know and if i get a critical hit i'll do so much damage but um let's just uh i think it works on horses let's just drink up and nope does it does it have to be on monsters because that would be terrible and maybe that's why i've been failing so much because this should do eight eight attack damage plus the strength potion should give me additional three hearts i believe so I should be doing 10, 11 hearts of damage easily. So hopefully within the next minute, I be I should be able to find some creatures. Um, so let me go do that. Okay, I have 30 seconds left, and I hear a creature. A uh, zombie somewhere. Cause what, uh, I only have 20, 20 seconds left. I gotta do this fast. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Come on, where's all the creatures at? There's a skeleton over there. 15 seconds. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9 eight seven six oh come on that did not do nine hearts of damage you gotta be kidding me what wait 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 deal nine hearts of damage in a single hit i had strength potion two plus that i should have easily done nine and a half hearts at least and i probably got a critical what is this like an, is this like an impossible achievement to get because I'm sure I just dealt nine hearts of damage 
let me go and uh, check this up again, see if it's actually possible, because uh, that achievement came out was, was an early achievement, so in 1.11, it may no longer be possible. So let me go and see if this is an, even a possible achievement. Okay, so I learned that what my problem was is I was thinking that when it says 8 attack damage, I was thinking 8 hearts of attack damage. No, it only does 8 hit points of attack damage, and, he, and so each hit point, so two hit points equals one heart, so technically the sword only does four hearts of damage, plus the additional six hit points from str uh, strength potion two makes it do, which is three extra hearts, makes this sword do seven hearts of damage with a uh, strength, uh, strength potion. So then if I were to do a critical hit, then maybe if I got like a really good critical hit and did 50% more damage, then I could reach 9 hearts, but the chances are low for that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get, I'm going to go and get 30 levels from the nether. So what I'm going to do is, I do have a slime ball. So I'm going to make myself some potions, uh, some magma creams, and I'm going to make myself uh, fire resistant potions. And redstone, I believe, will make it last 8 minutes each. So I just need some bottles. Uh, I can get Jake these as well. So I'm probably, so I'm going to go to the nether, and, yeah, so I'm going to go to the nether, and then hopefully get 30 levels, come back, maybe make another diamond sword possibly, enchant it with sharpness 5 hopefully, and then I should be able to d get the achievement done. Okay, so there we go, I got three potions of fire resistance, so I'm going to put these here, strength potions there. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to the nether, hopefully find a blaze spawner, and, uh, kill some blazes. And, uh, hopefully I don't die, and, uh, hope this works out. So I'm just gonna run over to a blaze spawner and get a whole bunch of experience. Okay, I found the spawner, and, uh, now I'm just gonna drink a potion of fire resistance. Um, throw on a strength pot for its last eight minutes each, and, uh, just... Hopefully, get some experience. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, these, things, these, guys, these guys drop a lot of experience, and because of my fire resistance, they can't touch me for the next eight minutes. So, I'm just going to be here for a while, killing a whole bunch of blazes. Actually, what I'm going to do is put a little dome around here so that they can't fly up above me, because that's like an annoying move of theirs where they like fly above you. And then you can't hit them really. Just a minute. Really? I'm trying to encap I'm trying to catch you guys. So why don't you guys not fly away? There we go. And uh yeah, I'm just gonna be doing this for a while. And then I'll just get a whole bunch of experience. Okay, after a very long time of killing very many uh blazes, finally have 30 levels. And so now gonna make another diamond sword and hopefully I can get 30 levels on this thing that uh, nah, I'm gonna get 30 levels hopefully I can get some uh, apparently Bane of Arthropods does uh, lots of da uh, um, a large number of damage um, so apparently sharp misses like the uh, no I don't uh, wait t level 28 why is it only a level 28 enchantment do I need more books? Maybe I need like two more books. Let's see. Do I have any leather? Oh, I do have leather. And do I have any sugar cane? I should have tons. And uh, I do have lots of wood. I know that. Okay, so maybe I need like a couple more bookshelves. Um, I don't need that many, but I'll just make this many anyways. See, so, now I need. I'll just make all this paper. Paper. I need lots of paper. There we go. Okay, seven and one and two and two and two. Two more bookshelves. And yeah. Cool. Let me just throw my paper in here. Let's try this again. And hopefully this time I'll be 30. Um, it'll be a thirty a level thirty enchantment. Let's see. Knock yeah, level thirty, knock back two. Sharpness too. No, I need like sharpness. Uh, I hate the new enchanting system where you can't 
actually change what it is. Our breaking one sharpness to our knockback two is like the only things it's like ever gonna allow me to do unless unless I enchant something else. I'd have to chant something else at a very low level, but then I'd have to go and get some more levels, which is gonna be very frustrating. So I'm just gonna go and just yeah, enchant this with like a level one. Maybe like efficiency or whatever. Doesn't matter, but that should change my options. Level one efficiency. Perfect. Now I have 29 levels, but let's see. On breaking three, smite one, or bane of arthropods one. Bane of arthropods apparently does a lot, but let me actually check up what the best one is to do this. So after checking it up, I found out that I'm going to want like a bane of arthropods or smite, because each each level like um, of bane of arthropods or smite adds uh, 2.5 hit points. So about one and a quarter heart extra of damage and uh, sharpness only adds it doesn't add that much um so still looking at my enchantments i can get for this it's still only on breaking or smite which is not going to be enough i'm going to need like a smite two or smite three so it looks like i'm going to have to go and enchant yet another something else maybe my bow uh maybe if there's a level th uh i don't want to spend all my 30 levels but let's see i'm breaking three i'm breaking okay can i get like a very no, a very low. I'm going. I'm going to need a very low one. Let's see. Four. Still too much. Um, maybe with these. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. There we go. I can go. That blocks off two. That blocks off two. Um, and up there. Maybe this will help. I don't know if that would do anything different. But I could try it out. Nope. Still one. I'm just gonna grab some or make some torches okay i got 30 levels and now i can just go over here and hopefully get some bane of arthropods four seven attack damage fire aspect two bane of arthropods oh that's so that's awesome it gave me like extra um extra achievements besides what i already uh ex not achievements extra damage and all that I don't want to sleep in bed. I need it to be night. Okay. So okay, there we go. Three strength potions. And now it's day. But hopefully there should be some spiders out. Oh, there's a spider here. Okay. Strength two. Should give me three extra hearts. So that should put me at... S okay, seven attack damage. Puts me at three and a half hearts. Plus another three hearts is six and a half hearts. Plus six and a half hearts plus four and a half should be 11 hearts of damage without even a critical. So let's do critical anyways. Yes! Achievement overkill. Okay. So finally, after a very, very long time of just like trying a whole bunch of things, finally got the achievement overkill and that was an overkill sword i did 11 hearts of damage possibly 15 if i got a critical hit so that is just yeah that took uh way longer than i expected way way longer than i expected but i got the achievement and so i'm just gonna call that an episode so this was starfleet 27 creators axel minecraft Season 1, Episode 17. If you did enjoy this video, then please hit that like button. Also, if you happen to find my channel and you enjoy my videos or this video, then uh, please hit that subscribe button. And thanks for watching.